How, how did you feel today? Well, you know, I, I was practicing really well during all the week. Today I was for sure nervous. Uh, that's normal. And, uh, it's normal to start a tournament like this with uh, some nerves and that's what happened today. And he, he didn't help because he played very fast all the time. All the shots was he trying. He was trying to do a winner in almost every shot. So <laughs> it was difficult for me to find to find the rhythm. Uh, anyway, it was a positive positive start, winning in straight sets, even if it was <laughs> unbelievable that I won in straight sets. But uh, it's a victory in straight sets. So happy for the victory. Happy to come back here in New York and. I think uh, I didn't play that bad, but yeah. the mental part was positive tonight. And, uh, the tennis for sure can improve. I have to play a little bit more inside the court, but uh, I am confident that I can do it. Rafa, are you uh, concerned at all about your serve? It was a big tease last year for you, and you were broken five times yeah. the whole tournament from 2010 and yeah. six times tonight. So. Uh, impossible to win this year, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> uh, no, uh, sure. The the serve was important. Was important part of my game last year, but uh, the serve helped me a lot to win the tournament. But I won the tournament because I was playing fantastic from the baseline. So my game is from the baseline. Uh, I never going to be a a serve a big. Uh, you know, myself never never gonna be huge. I know that, but uh, I can improve myself, and that's what I am doing. Today, I lost myself six times, and in my opinion, was not a fault of myself. <laughs> you know, it was a fault that he was returning very fast all the time. Sometimes I hit a very good serves, 120 seats, 128, and the ball came back. <laughs> Unbelievable fast, no? so, and you know uh, I was enough fast. I was not enough fast to 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 play aggressive with with the forehand. That's because I was a little bit more nervous. But uh, that's the score, that's the game, and uh, I lost six times myself. Was not myself the fault. <laughs> you know, I cannot be worried today having two days off, winning the first match. <laughs> if I am worried today, you know, uh, I cannot go to sleep to, tonight, tomorrow. <laughs> I'm not worried. Uh, I, I'm happy. I'm through. I didn't play a lot this summer. Uh, you know, but I had a fantastic week of practice here. Uh, I was practicing really well, much better than in the previous tournaments. So that's normal. Start like this. It's normal. Start with doubts. With more nervous, you know, uh, the confidence didn't come like this. You have to find your confidence. And the confidence is spending hours on court, comp competing better, winning the matches. Today was one of the matches. I'm, com I'm, I'm very happy to, to be through and I'm happy to be playing better. We'll see if I am ready to make this improve that I will make. Uh, how do you find the court? The I cannot say, but no, uh, I see the court pretty really similar than last year. But, uh, not my feeling, but you know, e everybody has a different feeling. Even in one, when you arrive to one tournament, for some players the court is very fast. For another players the court is not that fast. It depends how you are playing. You know, it depends what's your feelings, and your feelings are not the same every year. So your opinion about how you see the court depends how you are moving, how you are playing. And, you know, I, my feeling is the same. How are you moving and how are you playing? So? How are you moving and how are you playing? I, I already talked about that in 10 minutes. <laughs> I said uh, I, I had a fantastic week of practice. Today I played with more nerves. Today I played nervous. That's normal thing. You know, I I, lo I lost 
a few matches this summer, even if I had a fantastic season before, having uh, tough losses in finals. But this summer I didn't play a lot, so the confidence, I say, it, is, is not arriving fast, <coughs> especially if, if you don't win a lot of matches in, in the last tournaments. Even if I was practicing very well, for sure that's not enough. The important thing is have a victory like I had tonight. Rafa, you, you will play against Nicola Mayu next round. Are you ready to play uh, during 10 hours with Nicola Mayu? I am not ready to play 10 hours. <laughs> <laughs> that's not going to happen, you know. It's only very special situations and uh, in a very special matches between two big serves. <laughs> I, I will have. He will break me before. <laughs> how much does it help your confidence? Does it help your confidence that tonight, on the biggest points, you came up with your best shots? I had a few good passing shots in important moments. And it's to save set point in the, um, in the second, and you know, in the match point, I had a very good passing shot too. In the break point, in the first set, I think back end. Down the line, I had a good one too. Uh, I hit a, a good shot. I think I hit a good shot, but not enough. No. <laughs> I think uh, I hit a fantastic shot for a moment, but I didn't hit six, seven, eight points straight. Good shots, moving around, hitting forehands. The opponent didn't help me. That's that's the truth. I didn't play like this. For sure, always you, when you when you are when you are finding uh, problems, always the problem is here, it's not the opponent. But for sure the, the opponent was playing very fast and you know, the, the ball never came like this. <laughs> you touch the ball always came like this. So it was difficult to try to hit four or five four, four hands in a row, especially when you are a little bit nervous, your movements are a little bit slower. And, and that's what happened. Rafa, you said the other day, talking about Cincinnati, that didn't want to discuss the backhand because you had the burns on your fingers. Mm -hmm. Tonight it seemed like you were having problems getting some length on the two-handed backhand, maybe not the slice. And are the fingers okay? And did the fingers are much better. That? It's not 100% okay, but are much better. So uh, the problem is not the, the blisters <coughs> right now. Uh, I have how, how I hit the backhand is just a problem of decision to, to hit the backhand more inside the court. To, to play the backhand with a little bit more uh, confidence because I, I was doing really well during the, the previous week. So hopefully for next match I will do it better. And that's, that's the, the, the way. The people forget a lot of things, but uh, last year my first match was really bad. <laughs> that's true, even if I didn't lose my serve. <laughs> but uh, I played fast against a similar opponent than today. He played very fast. So it's a different situation, but um, yeah. it's very difficult to start one tournament playing very well from the beginning. Uh, that's not. I'm not saying that I will play fantastic <laughs> next days, but uh, I'm confident that I can do it better. You, you always put a, an awful lot into your, your practice sessions, Rafa, but do you think you perhaps practice with even greater intensity and for longer before this championship than you have for many championships. Sorry? Do you think you actually practice longer and with more intensity before this championship than you have mm -hmm. for many Grand Slams, just because you needed to get some more time on, on the court? Uh, my feeling was I, my movements, my movements during Montreal and Cincinnati wasn't perfect. Uh, and that's what, that was the biggest the biggest issue for me, you know, to, to, to improve. And I played, I practiced hard, I played, practiced with positive attitude all the moments. Uh, seriously, I, I'm very happy. I, I arrived here, I started to practice here on Monday. And since the first day that I was practicing here, my my feelings was much better than the, the previous tournaments. I think that the, the, the conditions Helped me a little bit more, but you know, uh, I didn't win a tournament. I didn't win a lot of matches, but I practiced <laughs> during that two weeks uh, with top level players. So that's that's for sure helped me to be 
in, in, in better conditions to, to, to ride here, and for sure that's, that's going to improve, no? But uh, I, didn't, I practiced at home three days, four days maximum before, the, before Montreal, and always it's tough at the beginning. Can we have the last English question? Well, but it hasn't been that long time-wise since you won Roland Garros, and you've talked a lot about confidence, but if you think back to how confident you felt after that, where you were.